we're back up in the kitchen for another Wellness Wednesday and a great recipe for you. I want to introduce our two guests here today. John Barahana with the Program Director of the Boys and Girls Club of Kern County. Going to show us a wonderful recipe. And we have Dr. Saul Diaz-Martinez, who's a pediatrician with Adventist Health. Welcome to both of you. Thank, thank you. All right, thank you so we're much. talking healthy eating. School is just about out. And so we're kind of trying to get some ideas for parents to th get things ready for the summer months. And uh, let's talk about that, John. What do you have on, on the recipe today? Um, no mayo coleslaw, you know, something a little bit different, try to, you know, keep it fresh for the summer as the heat's coming through. Um, so what we have is uh, cabbage, carrots, uh, apple cider vinegar, mm -hmm. honey, a little bit of olive oil, and then salt and pepper to taste. Very easy ingredients. You know, it's such a fast-paced world out there. Parents want a recipe they can do really quick, and the kids are uh, fueled up, ready for the day, and, and this says it here so yes, kind of how what's the process here all right so um, you want to chop up your veggies put them in the bowl set and then next we're just gonna mix all the ingredients together in a separate bowl mm -hmm. so we got our apple cider vinegar you want to do one third cup let's see right here Wow, there's nothing like the smell of vinegar. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and actually, you know, vinegar is such a good health benefit to you. Uh, doctor, talk a little bit about it because I've always been told uh, apple cider vinegar is really good for the gut health. Yes, so actually apple cider vinegar helps really good to improve your digestion. It also may be helping out on decreasing your levels of your blood sugar. So it's actually it's a great ingredient for us to have at everyday meals. So we're starting early with the kids. Exactly. <laughs> then we've got olive oil. Yeah, tablespoon of olive oil. So olive oil is fantastic because it's one of the single ingredients that are heart healthy, meaning that it can lower cholesterol. Also, it's very important for the development of our nervous system, which is directly involved in the developmental of our children. And if we start that early, then later on when they're adults like us, they're already getting a head start. Exactly. So if we start now when they're kids, by the time they are adult, they will be all full grown and ready to go. And then the next ingredient we just uh, were about to put in is yes. the honey. Yes. And I know honey is just important for so many aspects, but we live in a valley. There's a lot of folks that suffer from allergies and honey really helps. Exactly. So. Honey is one of these nature wonders, right? So it's a natural sweetener, it's hydrant, and also may have some natural antibacterial properties. But just remember that we do not recommend giving honey to children younger than one year old because of risk of botulism. So gotcha. everybody above one year is really good to have, especially if it's pasteurized honey. But before that one year, we do not recommend it. And that's uh, information I didn't even know. So good tip there for yes. parents out there. <laughs> all right, so we've got all that in the bowl, and then we're just adding some salt and pepper. Yeah. Salt and pepper to taste, and then we'll, we'll mix, mix it around it. in there. So we're kind of incorporating the honey, the vinegar, the olive oil all in this right now. Almost like a vinaigrette. It takes a little bit of extra time to get it all incorporated because of that thicker honey. Uh, but once we get it all mixed together, it makes for a, a delicious dressing, right? Yeah. It does look it's delicious. <laughs> it smells delicious. Yeah. yeah. All right. So then uh, after that's all mixed together, then we just kind of add it to the cabbage and incorporate it into the yeah. uh, cabbage and we'll just salad mixture. And just mix it all through. And then from there, perfect. From there, we kind of do that magic say. chef toss, yeah. <laughs> or use a spoon. Depends on how comfortable you are. Uh, and then we kind of just plate it, and this makes like a good lunch for the kids. Yep. And you know, measuring spoons are good all around. That's right, I use a measuring yeah. spoon. <laughs> You're good. I do this at home. I'll, I'll forget a spoon off to the side. I'm like, oh, I just got my measuring spoons. Why not just use that as a scooper, scoop it on out? Exactly. <laughs> and then you get that extra flavor from what was on the spoon as it was. So look at that, a beautiful coleslaw salad, healthy. Again, you get the apple cider vinegar, you get the honey, you get the olive oil, salt and pepper, all great ingredients uh, for the kids and a nice refreshing meal for the summer months. So uh, John, thank you for uh, joining us and also uh, Dr. Uh, Sol Diaz-Martinez, we appreciate your time. And now, time to make it at home for yourselves.